She was... Uh, that's a producer question, really. She was, I mean, uh, somebody who I, who I saw her first film, 13, and I thought it was absolutely incredible. I don't know if you've ever seen it. Mm -hmm. Beware yeah. anybody who's seen 13 and is a 13-year-old. And also the first Twilight, which I thought was really a stunning debut, actually, in terms of uh, creating a franchise. And so she has a, a number of things that I thought would be brilliant, actually, in, for, 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 for this movie. So I was really pleased, really pleased that she said yes, because it's a small British movie. It's an independent movie. It looks it looks Hollywood, but it's it's tiny. You know, it's it's, it's British British made. You, you mentioned it's British made. Um, how was it like having Americans on board then with Drew and with Catherine? Oh, they were great. I mean, you know, they're, they're so kind of... Drew is just so positive and so unstarry. Given that she's been a star since she was, you know, five years old, she is helpful, thoughtful, incredibly bright. Um, she's a director herself. She's a producer herself. She knows. And Catherine too. They're both really smart women. And so the fact they're American, you know, that would be kind of, I don't know, it would be terrible to make any kind of comment about that just because they're from somewhere else. So it's... Um, it's, it was great, it was great. And in fact, I think that their way of embracing kind of London was, was great too. Um, some very emotional scenes written, I guess, and also in the film. Were there any that you thought they did particularly well in terms of bringing it onto the screen? Oh, wow. I think they did all of the scenes incredibly well. I mean, they were very challenging, a lot of the things that they had to do. And there was some improvisation there. They, they worked with the material. They, they really bounced off each other, all of the actors. And uh, it was an incredible experience to watch them work. I, I find there are certain things I find really funny and certain things I find very moving. And there's a particular scene between the two of them where, where um, Tony's character makes herself very, very vulnerable to Drew uh, just after she's come back from hospital. And uh, I think that's one of my favorites. Thank you very much. Cheers. Thank you very much. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, you're watching Hey You Guys. Hey You Guys, huh? Hey you guys, yeah. Is that from the Goonies? It is indeed, yeah. Nice.